Hamilton. We're actually sitting under a parking garage right now. We have some delicious uh, beverages. Slush puppy. I wish we had more time. We literally have no battery or capacity on the disc. So it's gonna be it's gonna be This is super review. abbreviated. But hers bacon cheddar cheese curls. I got these at Ollie's discount store. There's several interesting varieties, about a half dozen. I was curious to try. Actually, me and my friend Tim on the Brian and Tim show recently, I don't know when it, it probably has already aired. Uh, we tried the blue cheese, buffalo blue cheese. They were awesome. So I'm, I have high expectations going into this. This is the bacon cheddar flavor. Now, I've always been a bacon cheddar fan. You can get like the bacon cheddar uh, cheese uh, or like potato skins. And I like getting those. Now on the back, it says, live life with flavor. You know I do. Man. Not These are good. Say. They're light. They're fluffy. They're hers. Um, cheese doodles that I've had are good. I mean, they're as good if not better than the, the main brand. These are actually, yeah, these are really good. Uh, and I, I was getting ready to say that I didn't taste the bacon at all. And then right at the end, there's kind of a wash of uh, bacon flavor. That is my only uh, minor complaint is that the bacon, it's a bit on the back end. Uh, lately I've really gotten, I've never been a huge Pringles guy, but they're loaded baked potato Pringles. It's basically like a cheesy bacony Pringle. Are right, addicting. I've been eating a lot of those the past few months. Um, these are good. Um, I mean, I, I, I would recommend them, I, I yeah. guess I would say. If they were if they were in a bowl or party, you know, I know we typically go to this, I could snack on them, you know, they're really good. Yeah, the more that I eat them, Especially as I'm looking at that dust, that flavor dust off my fingers, I'm getting more of that salty, that bacon. So it is there, but it doesn't completely uh, override the, the cheese puff flavor. No, yeah, I was, I thought it would be a stronger flavor, but it's not. You know, I'm pretty happy with that. All right, man, we're gonna wait out here and see if uh, any ladies of the night come walking by. I don't have a lot of money on me, but I got a slush puppy. I want to know what that gets. I'm gonna sprinkle these on their kicks. <laughs> Hey everybody, it's Brian. Eddie. And the sky, well the sky's not falling, it's not chicken little, but the sun is, is going down, it's getting dark. We're doing an energy drink review, maybe to pep us up a little bit. Oh man, I'm tired. Don't You've had a long this. day, this guy works third shift, hard working man, blue collar. Now today's energy drink review, it's Rip It Energy Tribute. Oh, active, Rip It, I've had Rip It. Active I've Mandarin and Live Wild Lime. Very it's, interesting. It's alive? It, it's alive. I, I it's a living live organism. Fire, live wild one. Anyway, so Rip It actually has been covered on Review the World around 2006. Uh, like, what, eight years ago? Yeah, I believe uh, you drank it in a vehicle. Yeah, we did that for one of the earliest incarnations of Review the World TV back in 2006. Summer of, so some eight years later. Um, now, I was at a store that has a wide variety of energy drinks. This one caught my eye, Tribute. Now, in no way, I, I don't want people to get the wrong impression. You hear the crickets, the cicadas and stuff. You know we're in Ohio, baby. Um, but we're in no way laughing. This, because, it, you know, it's, this is nothing about the truth. I just thought it was a silly kind of concept. But this is in no way, shape, or form a knock on the troops, uh, you know, the proud men and women who serve. Um, but I just thought it was such an interesting thing. I have to taste it. Um, it really stuck out to me. I have a question. It yeah. Says active Mandarin. Now, are they referring to the Iron Man villain Mandarin? Oh, ooh. Ben, Probably uh, ben, not, ben right? Kingsley and Iron Man 3. That was a nice twist. No, this is a Mandarin Orange Lime Together Energy Drink. Uh, two, the, the camo. The, the camo on the package. I mean, it's a pretty cool can. Um, I don't know. It was just interesting enough the, to get, grab my attention. I will say this. For a guy that's pretty careful about what I put in my mouth, um, don't drink a lot of alcohol or soda. But I will admit, in the past few months, I've kind of been drinking energy drinks. Just uh, not so much for the energy to run around, but at, late at night, just the mental acuity, the sharpness, and focus. When I'm focusing on a task, when I'm working on the website, or I'm watching a film, uh, you know, keep me up a couple hours too. Yeah. I, I get up pretty early. I got kids. Um, I'm a big fan of Monster myself. And my my drink of preference is a Nos the original, the orange one. Uh, probably my favorite, but. It tastes bad. like Surge. You remember Surge? It does. It, it tastes, tastes like Surge. This tastes exactly oh, wow. like Surge. It's super, it's really citrusy. It doesn't have that strong, 
almost artificial, funky, you know, aftertaste that a lot of energy drinks have. If it does, it's a lot more subtle. Um, but it is really citrusy and very bubbly, the, the finish. It's pretty dang good. Yeah. Like, my, my initial impression, I'm, I'm kind of surprised. Um, I'm going to take one more drink. I can taste that orange in the lime. That's pretty good. Now, it's going to be interesting because the next two guys that we're going to be bringing in right now, they don't really like energy drinks at all. So, um, Eddie and I, I think we both give this a, a thumbs up. Two thumbs up. And uh, let's get these other guys in here and see what they think. 100 calories. Just so you know. Hey, I'm Chris. Hey, and this is Nick here. And we are reviewing uh, Rip It Tributes. Um, now I'd like to make a correction. What does an HSD say, Nick? This is just a tribute. <laughs> this is not the greatest song in the world. No! <laughs> this is just a tribute. All right, sorry about that. Uh, Musical interlude. Uh, now I make a correction here. It's not that I don't like energy drinks at all. Mm. Um, I used to be a huge fan of energy drinks. I used to drink them all the time, particularly Rip It. I used to get Rip It. Um, it was great. And it, it was my favorite energy drink of all time for a long time. And, I mean, I dug Nas and Monster was, you know, it was okay, but I don't know what it was within the past few years. Um, my body made some transition into a state to where if I drink an energy drink, if I were to drink half of this, I would go into a panic attack and it would take oh, me out. Oh, anxiety. To it's something They do, do say anxiety. that like every seven years or so your body changes what it craves, what it oh. needs. And and maybe maybe your body it. just moved beyond it. Uh, you gave with, it all the energy it needs. <laughs> with that said, I'll go ahead and take a sip here and try it. I think I'll be all right. If not, we'll lock you in this barn like uh, Evil Dead. We'll just yeah. oh my we'll gosh. chain them up. Yeah, I'm a little excited about the, the Surge reference from earlier because yeah, I, I love Surge. It's kind of funny, but um, I was sitting here thinking about Brian and Eddie talking about Surge. As soon as I tasted it, Surge right off the bat, which is really weird. And I don't That's going to make some people happy out there that are looking for yeah. a Surge replicate. Yeah. Yeah, Damn. I mean, I don't want to jump on the bandwagon and be like, oh, it's Surge, because that's what everybody it's else delicious. tastes, but that's what it's comes... good. It if have anything, it's like Surge, surge but it has the taste. It's just like a slight, like, sun-kissed. Yeah, yeah, that's, it does, the orange and the lime are both there. Because you can taste the orange. They're both there, which is but it's, pretty they're, remarkable. They're very balanced. For something I got as more of a gag, almost, item, just to kind of, oh, this is funny, this is unique. Drink. It's surprisingly good. I think we're gonna be fighting for the Just one more last, time. last drink. You know what, let's, one let's, drink to rule them all. Ah. Oh no, damn it! The guy with the robotic arms got it. No, he wins. <laughs> yeah, of course.